We all know someone getting older, and facing the inevitable changes that come with aging. However, despite what many people still believe, illnesses such as Alzheimer's disease are not part of the normal process of aging and can be tackled. Alzheimer's Research UK, the UK's leading dementia research charity, launched their hashtag share the orange campaign in 2016 to raise awareness of the disease and send the message that ongoing research may make progress into slowing the disease, if not stopping it. Alzheimer's Research UK is always working with supporters to raise awareness and improve understanding of the condition. Their research revealed that people were eager for a symbol that simplified the issues around dementia in an easy and informative way. The campaign distilled a complex subject into the clear visual metaphor of an orange to explain the damage caused by Alzheimer's disease. The average adult human brain weighs about 1,300 to 1,400 grams, whilst the brain of a person with Alzheimer's disease weighs around 140 grams less. This equates to about the weight of an orange. A number of prominent people came forward to share their stories and connect with supporters. Brian Cranston, the star of Breaking Bad, was one such supporter who produced and starred in a short film created by Aardman Animations. The film questioned prevailing notions and stereotypes about dementia by combining live action, stop motion, and CGI animation, centered on the symbol of an orange. As the impact of the disease is described, the layers of the orange gradually dissolve to show how dementia physically affects the brain. Not every charity can benefit from being associated with such prominent spokespeople. But every charity can strive towards creating a narrative suited to the world of social media, one that is shareable, easily recognized, and simple to understand. Alzheimer's Research UK has been able to create a social media campaign that plays a part in reducing the effect of fatalism that surrounds the diagnosis of Alzheimer's disease. People who feel that dementia is an inevitable result of the aging process are unlikely to have much faith in preventative strategies. Misconceptions about the disease can also present barriers to people supporting the funding of research. Alzheimer's Research UK invests more than £20 million in pioneering research every year. This is vital to support new projects, as well as ongoing studies, for example research into dementia risk factors and how to protect brain health. Studies have already discovered that brain health is shaped throughout life. Early life experiences, including education, play a role in dementia risk. In addition, health changes in a person's midlife, such as faster rises in blood pressure, are linked to signs of blood vessel damage and smaller brain size by age 70. Findings of the studies suggest that increasing or high blood pressure, even in a person's 30s, could have a knock-on effect on brain health four decades later, according to researchers. Other studies, like those at the University of Camerino in Italy, are investigating whether sleep can slow down the buildup of a toxic protein, called tau in the brain. Researchers hope to discover whether using certain techniques to promote deep sleep can slow the buildup of tau, therefore delaying the onset of Alzheimer's disease. The findings will help inform further research into whether sleep enhancement techniques, like rocking motions and listening to soothing music, can be used to help reduce a person's dementia risk. In the meantime, Alzheimer's Research UK. Continue to educate the public with a regular blog. The blog highlights dementia-related topics such as diabetes and brain health, spotting the early signs of dementia, the science behind staying sharp and unaddressed midlife hearing loss in people with dementia. Facebook posts on their page, Alzheimer's Research UK take their approach of providing easily digestible pieces of information about their research, as well as stories from people affected by the disease.